But uh, how did you get onto uh, onto Doug and playing Patty? Oh, okay. It's, it's actually, actually a pretty cool story. I um, uh, I can't remember what year it was that mm -hmm. it started. You would probably know better than me. Either it was late eighties or early nineties, but I. Um, I get you. I used to take aerobics. It was when aerobics was really yeah. um, Pilates now is the new aerobics, but aerobics mm -hmm. was everything. There was a studio on the Upper West Side um, that I used to go to all the time. Mm -hmm. um, at the same time that I was going to take these exercise classes, I was doing a series of, I became a spokesperson for Kraft Mayonnaise. Mm -hmm. And I started doing all these mayonnaise commercials and yeah. it was just me and I had this big wig on. And so I was, I was on these um, commercials for years. So these commercials about mayonnaise were running. Mm -hmm. I was taking this aerobics class. Uh, one of the aerobics instructors came up to me and said, my husband is, um, making this wants to make this uh cartoon uh -huh. he heard your voice watching your mayonnaise commercial and he was like that's the voice i want to use for one of the characters and she was like oh she's in my aerobics class mm -hmm. i can ask her you know i can ask her for you yeah and so she did and she said would you mind coming up to our home and recording uh, something for my husband of this thing that he's written. And, you know, I was like, it's so funny because now I'd be like, would I have just gone? Mm -hmm. You know, but this is ch uh, changing times. Yeah. And yeah. I was like, sure. And so um, I went up to their house. They were up near me. I went up to their house and he had a little recorder mm -hmm. and he had, you know, some of the material out maybe told me a little bit about it. I mean, it was really early. Yeah. And so I recorded a couple of things for him and I left and I would see her, you know, at aerobics again. And um, I didn't think anything of it. You know, I'm like, okay, it's just some something that's gonna go nowhere. Yeah. Like a lot of things do. And then I don't know whether it was a couple of months later, but my agent called me and said, so they want to record some episodes for this Doug thing. I hadn't even remembered that he was calling it. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, what are you talking about? And then, and then the rest is sort of history, but that's, that's how it started for me.